But hey guys, now I got a fire going. Burning off a lot of stuff. Emptying out the storage unit. Now that I got my building built, it's about seven o'clock and you can see it's a full moon tonight, baby. Beautiful. I don't know if that makes a difference or not. <laughs> but uh, we got a lot of trash to burn. As you know, we got everything ready. The metal is in. Brian's not going to be able to get back here until next week. That gives me an ample amount of time to go ahead and empty out the storage unit and build whatever I got to build. And I can rent the Bobcat. Uh, it's awful dark. I got the uh, storage room. Let me walk over closer. I'm already loading it up. It survived 42 mile an hour winds. So, I know the, I know for a fact, I could put my stuff in there and be safe. All right. This is what it's like at seven o'clock at night. You can't see anything. It's gonna be a quick video. I still have to make dinner. But uh gotta break down all this stuff. Gotta start itemizing everything out. My neighbors cut down a bunch of trees up here. I can go get all the residuals, chainsaw them up, and start making my wood pile right over here. So, it's going to be a quick video. I don't even know if you can see me, but I'm going to try. I'm good. You know? Every day is a new challenge. Got to empty out the storage in it. Got to do it by the 5th. So I have a couple days. And uh, keep soldiering on. Man, it's pretty dark out here. I got a bunch more to put on here. But I wanted to give you a quick video, let you know I'm okay. Uh, I survived the 42 mile an hour winds, so did the shed. Everything took its test. And now we know the weak spots and the strong spots. So I'm gonna make arrangements to get, you know, get some wire and then uh, I bolt into the, uh, some, maybe some four by fours in the ground and lock this thing down so it could it handle a hundred mile an hour winds. Cause you never know. Uh, it, it gets froggy up here. So, I'm happy, I'm healthy, I hope everybody else is. You know, we got an election coming up. You got to survive it. Let's see what happens. Um, had a great conversation with a friend of mine. And uh, possible work. Got to pass a few tests and spend a little money. But, you know, it's, uh, it's a better guarantee than... Giving somebody ninety nine thousand dollars on YouTube to be rich the next day, you know, it just doesn't happen. Scam. You gotta, you gotta think. You know, I, I'm surviving on savings. Uh, no stimulus. Government has turned their back on us 
for their political gain. And uh, it's unfortunate because we hired them to work for us and they no longer care about us. They just care about their forward momentum. So it's unfortunate. So I can't guarantee anything from the government, but I can guarantee you I get the roof on this thing. I can button it up and go back to work and come back intermittently. Maybe put a fence up first, but I need to go back to work. It's enough already. Can't count on the government. So have a good night. That's my fire. And we'll talk to you soon.